hi and welcome to another video in this video i'll show you how to save your projects in ableton live so what happens is sometimes you save the project and after that you copy your project to your external hard drive and let's just say you go to your friend's place and you try to upload the same project in his laptop and the audio files are missing right so the one way that you save your project in Ableton is uh, by clicking on file here and after that you save live set and you save it and that is it right so what happens is you copy that project as I told you to your hard disk and let's just say you go to some studio right when you copy that same project to another laptop and you open it the audio files are missing I'll just show you how to save your projects so that you don't have to face the same thing of missing files so let's just start the video as i told you there is one way that we save our project as by you know save live set or save live set as and another thing that you can do is for example i'll just create a new folder here and let's just say i'll call it one two three okay so i have a folder here okay so first of all what you have to do is you have to go on files and then you click on a save live set as and now what i'll do is i'll go to desktop and i'll just save it collect all and save so i've saved the file here right now what i'll do is i'll go on the files again and now i will click on collect all and save so now we have this dialog here and it says specify which used media files are to be copied into the project right so files from somewhere else yes i want to copy files from somewhere else like uh, you know you have audio files which are saved in uh, different folders right and then uh, files from other projects let's just say you have copied audio files from another projects right and then files from user library files that are present in user library right here user library right and uh, files from factory packs so files from factory packs uh, like you know you have these options here and another so basically it's better to say yes to all so that you don't miss out on anything all right so next thing that i'll do is i'll just press ok okay so now files are all copied then i will again go on files here and this time we'll click on manage files okay now just to be sure that we haven't missed out on anything right before copying this project to the external hard disk okay or your external drive so i'll click on this manage project and now let's see it says this project contains 34.5 mb of data and then blah 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 74 media files zero defects and then we have this option missing files so now it says one file used by this project is missing and that is this audio file right so now i'll show you how you can locate this file and save the project so that you don't miss out on anything so i'll click on locate here right so first of all you have this option automatic search and if you'll press go on it so 99 percent of the time ableton automatically searches the missing file for you right and it's 99 correct and let's just say if one percent it's not 
you can you know search it manually on which folder this file is or you know you have loaded some sample from another folder and ableton is not able to locate it so you can do it manually okay but uh, most of the time automatic search works so let's see if uh, ableton can search this missing files for us i'll just uh, press on go here so now it says uh, six new candidates were found three missing files were replaced automatically so this is the way by which you can uh, you know let ableton search for your missing files and now next thing that you can do is you can save it again and now this project here collect all and save what you can do is uh, you can uh, you know copy this project to your external hard drives and then you can easily open these projects in any computer or laptop right so i hope that uh, if you had any doubt or you faced such problems so this video will help you out right so do let me know in comments if you like this video and uh, thank you so much for watching till then cheers and take care